Okay, well, if you are looking for good Thai food in Austin, I think we've found it this morning. We are inside Didi North Thai Street Food Truck, which is pretty new, just opened on East Cesar Chavez, and I've got Justin and Lakana, the owners here with me. I'm sure they're gonna be whipping up something delicious. Uh, Justin, how have things been since you guys opened? Uh, overwhelming, it's been really, really positive. A lot of great feedback, and we're having a hard time keeping up with the demand, so good. it's been great. It's a good problem to have. Yeah, it is, it is. Tell us a little bit more about the truck. Uh, so basically, it took me two years to convince her to do this. She's very <laughs> shy about her cooking, but you know, we really miss the food and the flavors that we ate in Thailand. Mm -hmm. So when we moved to America to get married two years ago, it was hard to find like those same dishes from her hometown. Yeah. So really what we're trying to bring is just share our love for the food in Thailand, the food from her hometown mm -hmm. that her and her grandmother would cook uh, growing up since she was a little girl. So Aww. that's what we're trying to, to bring to Austin, just you know, a little part of ourselves and share it with people. Very and, neat. And yeah, it's been great because everyone really is positive about yeah. it. So, yeah. Well, I'm sure a lot of those recipes are delicious. Tell us a little bit about what Lakana is going to be making. So she's making Som Tom right now. This is a papaya salad. Ah, it's freshly yes. shredded papaya, carrots, uh, cherry tomatoes, uh, roasted peanuts, and then fresh cut Thai chilies. Mm -hmm. And then also has some uh, Thai sauces in there. And this is a very spicy dish. Um, I don't typically recommend it for a first try okay. because it is, it is, you know, it takes some practice to eat, but Thais eat this every day. Because it's so spicy, it's it takes so, practice? Yeah, it, it takes some time <laughs> to get, get used, used to, to the spice. Yeah, And, you know, people that know this dish, they come seeking it and mm -hmm. they love it. Um, and it goes really good with another entree, uh, okay. something that can kind of help counterbalance the spice. Uh, so she's smashing everything together. So it's just crushing all the papaya, the tomatoes, the peanuts, and you That's eat, a huge part of the process and what makes part, it yeah, taste like yeah. it does. And this, and this takes about, you know, six minutes to make. That's a beautiful salad. Yeah, it is. And it, it goes really well with an entree, something that, you know, you can kind of mm -hmm. eat with the spice and all that. So. All right, yeah. let's show some of these other dishes. Yeah, so, so this is the... So this is the mango and sticky mm -hmm. rice, which is really great after a spicy meal. Uh, it's very light, sweet, and just from the mango and the coconut milk. And this has been very, very popular. And this is our biggest seller here. Mm -hmm. This is the Pad Kapow. Oh, sorry, this is the Om Gai. This ah. is a rustic urban herbal chicken dish uh, that she grew up cooking and eating almost daily with her mom. Oh, it smells and delicious, too. this is zucchini. It has a lot of dill, spring onion, lemongrass. Um, it's a very strong herbal taste, and it mm -hmm. has a little bit of a soupy broth. And with this dish, you eat with sticky rice. So it's almost like bread and pasta, where you dip the sticky rice into the sauce and eat it like that. And then this is the pasta pal, and this is the most popular mm -hmm. dish, and we it just, it's been crazy. Uh, this is a minced pork dish. Um, it has all her spices and chilies in there. It's on top of jasmine rice. It has fried basil and a fried egg on top, and it comes with a side of chili fish sauce, which is kind of what Thais use as the salt in the dish, and it adds salt and spice that brings out all the flavors. Wow. And then the sliced cucumber is there to kind of cleanse the palate. It mm -hmm. also helps with the spice. Uh, and this has been really, really, really popular. Yeah, I bet. That looks delicious. And then this refreshing looking beverage. That's our Thai iced tea. Okay, we and try we, that. Yeah, we try to make it not too sweet. Um, you know, just a little bit of sweetness mm. in there. It has a... Uh, oh yeah, that's really good. We make a big batch of that on the pot in the morning. Yeah. And then that's poured on ice and wow. uh, drizzled with the condensed milk and a splash of half and half. So good. All right, Didi Northern Thai yep. Street Food. That's us. Delicious, can't yep. wait to try everything on East Cesar Chavez. Thank you, both yeah. of you, Justin and Lakana. Thank Lakana. you so much. We appreciate it.